everyone it's Sue I'm back today with just a little haul video I haven't done one of these for a while I haven't really been doing much shopping which is good I've been trying to use up um, things that I have but anyway I went and did a little bit of um, op shopping and I happened to go into TK Maxx I absolutely love TK Maxx and I picked up a few bits and pieces from there as well so I'll just start with the uh, serviettes, napkins. Um, so I will use some of these for um, Christmas lunch and Christmas dinner as well. Uh, but I thought I might send some off in Happy Mail as well. Just a beautiful uh, Christmas tree. $4.99 for uh, 40 napkins. So that's a bit of a bargain, I think. And... So there's four trees on each. So they'd be beautiful on cards or in the journals on your pages. So there's those. And then I just couldn't resist these. <laughs> um, just a bit of fun. I love pink and, and teal. So uh, I grabbed those as well. Same, $4.99. 40 a packet. I'll just unpack the pink ones. I'm pretty sure there'll be four, four images on each get into them isn't he gorgeous yeah so there's four images on each these are so sweet so in the pink and the teal so the teal Santa's is a little bit different it's in a um, in a ute or a f100 so they are really cute. So I'll be gifting some of those as well. Um, oh, I found this. <laughs> it had my initial on it, so I had to have it. I mean, I don't need 20 uh, napkins with my initial on it. So if there's anybody in my um, Facebook group with their initials uh, S, uh, keep an eye out. You'll probably get some. <laughs> But they didn't have the whole alphabet, so I wanted to get some for a couple of friends, but they didn't have um, the letters, but I thought they were quite cute. And they've got uh, butterflies and mushrooms, very much what I like. So they were a bit of fun. Love these. Um, I can't remember how much these were. I think they're only like $4 or something. Um, and there's 20 napkins in the packet. Just think they're so beautiful with the eucalyptus and the roses, just very pale. Um, and same thing, four images. And then I found some um, William Morris, 3.95, so cheap. So 20 napkins. I won't take these out of the packet because you can see uh, pretty much what they look like. Just trying to get the best image here without too much glare. Um, maybe I will take them out. So that's the bluey colored one. And the maroon. So aren't they lovely? So for four dollars, you can't can't complain, I don't think. So I will be gifting some of those as well. Okay, so also at TK Maxx, I've picked this up. I just fell in love with it. First, I thought it was a book, and I thought, oh, that's gorgeous. I could make a journal out of that. And then it's actually a box. So I may even I love Paris. I've never been. We were going last March, but it didn't happen. Um, so I may even make a little journal and put it in here as a keepsake for myself. I've just got to get all these stickers off here. So um, that was just a little fine for me. I think that was $24. So it was a little bit of a splurge, but I fell in love with it. So I grabbed it. Um, I also picked up from, I found a new um, op shop just outside of town so I've been meaning to get there but just never really because it's you know down down the hill from where we live 
anyway, we popped in there the other day. We're coming back from um, Brisbane and went and had a look. So I got these for $50, $50, sorry, 50 cents for the set. So they're like got a fabric paint. I forget what that's called. It used to be the Rage in the 70s. But I just loved this. I thought, you know, I can use these in my journals or make little um, envelope little envelopes to go in the journals, you know, fabric envelopes, stitching them all up and anyway, you get the idea, that sort of thing. So for 50 cents for one, two, three, four of them, that's pretty good. So I got those and these were 50 cents each, but I don't think she charged me 50 cents each because um, I got all these and a couple of books for $5. So uh, I think I might've got this whole, these for 50 cents for the whole set as well. These are really pretty. This one's quite stained, but I'll probably end up coffee staining them anyway. So I'm currently doing some cheesecloth. So I might, once it's dry, I might coffee stain some of these. I got this uh, for a dollar. It's a, a small tablecloth, but it's all embroidered. Uh, you can see there, so some beautiful floral images on there that I can use in the journals. And that was a dollar, so an absolute bargain. And then this, I think I got for, I don't know, I honestly don't know, 50 cents probably for the set as well. They're just little serviettes. And they've just got this little cross stitch on each corner. So these have a bit of staining on them as well, but I will um, coffee, wash them and the coffee dye them as well. So I thought that was an absolute bargain because it's quite stained. So that was really good. Um, and then I found, I'm always on the lookout for atlases because I like to do up my kits for my workshops using atlas pages. Um, and I found this one and I think this was a dollar. I'm sure she said it was a dollar. Um, so it's got some really lovely, it's all matte, matte paper, uh, really good condition. So there's so many ways that you could utilize this in your journals and ephemera. So I've got that one and I also got this beautiful old big one. Now you're probably not going to see all of this in on screen but look at that image on the front. Isn't that beautiful? It's a concise atlas of the earth. So I'll open it this way. Um, oh look at that, didn't see that. How gorgeous is that? Wow. So some more beautiful. Oh, look at all that. So it's gorgeous. Absolutely love it. So it'll probably sit for a while before I decide to um, take the pages out. I love using all the, um, the index and everything as well. So that is beautiful. And that end page, that the colouring on that is just stunning. So that's just my mini haul. Um, I just thought I'd pop in and share it with you before I go and put everything away. I'm trying to put everything away as I get it um, so that I know where everything is and that I utilise it. So just a quick video today. I um, hope you're all keeping really well, managing to get some creative time in. So until next time, keep creating. Bye-bye.